Ezio! Dio mio! You're alive! I is it true? They say you killed the Doge. I was trying to save him, Leonardo. But the truth matters little. I failed. And now I'm the most wanted man in Venezia. Well, perhaps you are in luck. It's Carnevale in Venezia. This is the time when everybody goes without a face. That's why I'm here. Do you have a mask I can wear? Of course, of course. Somewhere in here. Grazie, amico mio. And I have something for you. Oh, more of the Codex. Aha. Uh -huh. This one's quite complex. Hmm. It's a new design, my friend. A mechanism for your wrist, but not a blade. In fact, it seems to be a kind of arma da fuoco, but as small as a hummingbird. Is that possible? I have no idea. Let's build it and find out. All right, well, I just loved that lag. All right, now I'm gangster at you. Hey, uh, bang. Bang. Apparently I have to go down right here. There we go. And I'm a pimp. I just need to get a gold, a gold wrist pistol. Now that would be pretty kick-ass. You done me good, brother. Macerto, but I'm sure your return was not just to play with new toys. Is it about this terrible new dodge they've installed? Marco Barbarico. Then you'll want to speak with your friend Antonio. I've seen him quite a bit lately at uh, a mutual friends. I'd look for him there, in the Dorsoduro district, to the south. Ask for Sister Teodora. Sister? Well, then... <clears throat> In a way, yes, sister. And Ezio, you. you can't be carrying weapons out there today. <laughs> Grazie, Leonardo. Now, about that mask. Looks weird as hell. Antonio, we need to talk. Ezio! Ezio Auditore! Teodora, meet the most uh, <coughs> talented man in all of Venezia. Madonna. Ah, Sister Teodora. I never imagined you as a religious type. <laughs> It depends how you understand religion, my son. It's not just men's souls that call for soothing. Come! Join us, Ezio. Have a drink. Meet the ladies. Ah! Murderer! Butcher! 
this lies Lucia and stole her money. So, Messer Ezio, let's see just how talented you are. After him. All right, I'll kick his ass. He's dead. I just shot him. <laughs> you have our gratitude, Ezio. Why is it wherever you go, trouble follows? Antonio, I trust you know why I'm here. I imagine to read Venice of Marco Barbarico. But really, Ezio, we did this once already. And this new Templar Doge is a bigger culo than the last. Never mind that he never leaves the palazzo. Yes, except for tonight. Marco wouldn't dare miss Carnevale. How do you know this? In fact, he's throwing the biggest party of them all. But getting in won't be so simple. You'll need a golden mask for entry. And before you think about forging one, keep in mind, each mask is numbered. Fortunately for you, I have an idea. Let's see if we can't win you a mask. Alright, winning, I guess. What is it, my son? You want to ask me something? I do. Forgive me, but why is it you wear a nun's habit if you aren't one? <laughs> Whoever said I wasn't. Indeed, I am married to the Lord. And yet you are also a courtesan. You run a bordello. So? I see no contradiction. How I choose to practice my faith. What I choose to do with my body. These are my choices to make. Like many young women, I was drawn to the church, but grew disillusioned by the believers of the city. Men hold God only as an idea in their heads, not in the depths of their hearts and bodies. Men must know how to love in order to reach salvation. My girls and I provide that to our congregation. No church would agree with me, I realized, so I created my own. It may not be traditional, but men's hearts grow firmer than my care. Among other things, I'm sure. Signore, come on, come all! The games of Carnevale are about to begin. Do you have the coraggio to compete for as grand a prize as this? This year, like every year, the Golden Mask will provide entry for one, a uno solo, to our most beloved Doge's personal ball. Who would not desire such an exceptional reward? Come! Compete! Whoever proves themselves champion in each of four games today shall be the Doge's personal guest tonight. You'd best get to it, Ezio. Welcome! Gentlemen, whether you win or lose, this will certainly be your favorite game of the day. Ladies! Here's how the game is played. All the ladies in the district have ribbons. Your job is to obtain them. Whoever has the most before my hourglass runs out is one step closer to winning the golden mask. Okay. I'm guessing they're on their butts because I'm probably going to be pickpocketing them. Okay. Hello, ladies. Come inside. Have 
coming for me, belle mia. Would I trouble you for a ribbon? You're all looking lovely this afternoon. Mind if I join you? Hello, ladies. Have anything for me, belle mia? Mind if I join you? have more ribbons than any man here. You've proved yourself a favorite of the ladies and are now one step closer to the greatest prize of all time. Well, yes, of course, because obviously touching a girl's butt obviously makes you the best of the ladies. I should try that. Just kidding. Welcome, welcome. The rules of the game are simple. Outrun your opponents Take the flag from the middle of the field and bring it back to your starting position to score. If the opposition holds the flag, you must knock them down to steal it. Be the first to capture the flag three times, and the golden mask may yet be yours. Is it okay if I kill my opponent? I thought not. protected your flag and captured the enemies. You've proven yourself a warrior without fear and inch ever closer to victory. Welcome, benvenuti. Are you ready to test yourselves with a game of speed and endurance? Many challenges lie in your path. The game is simple, but finishing it, near impossible. Start when you're ready. The first contestant to beat the course record is one step closer to the Golden Mask. Okay. And I am that much of a winner. Yes, let the hooker come up with me. The winner! You've proven yourself the fastest and strongest in Venezia! You are now one step closer to the grand prize! They were pissed. Benvenute Lottatori! The game is simple. There's only one rule, no weapons. Fight until you are the last man left standing. Will it be you or two? Hmm. Who will win the golden mask? I will. I've been trained for this shit ever since I was a baby. I'm like that kid from 300. I've been trained to kick ass. Come on, bitch. himself some kind of campion. Go on, Dante. Show him how sadly mistaken he is. Fucking eat shit.
Is there nobody else to challenge our man in the ring? Do we have a winner? Ah, we have combatants! So that's how it's going to be, eh? Looks like we have a winner. Signore e signori, the games of Carnevale have come to a glorious conclusion. Come see our winner claim. And I'm covered in blood. Our winner has proven himself the fleetest of foot, the strongest of champions. The Why is my cut open on my face? A favorite of the ladies. With four games won, Lealmente, the winner of the Golden Mask is... <laughs> the winner of the Golden Mask is Dante Moro. Congratulations. We'll see you this evening. Looks like I'm gonna have to kill Dante for the mask. I'm sorry, Ezio. We could not have known Silvio would cheat as he did. <laughs> you should have. Sister, you told us to let you know if we saw that rotting Kulo who stole the golden mask. He's on his way to the Doge's party. I will go. I can catch him before he arrives and take back the mask. How? By killing the poor Stronzo? Yes. You know what's at stake. No. If you kill him, they'll cancel the party. And Marco will retreat back into his palazzo. We'll have wasted our time again. Steal the mask instead. Quietly. My girls can help. They're already on their way to the party, all along the route. They can help you distract him while you acquire the mask. Va bene. I can do that. I guess of course because I blend perfectly in here. Now I look like something really fuggly. Buonasera, signore. We made it. Marco is on a boat, just offshore. He's set to make a speech in a few minutes. Use my girls until then. Move with them to stay out of sight.
find him. Shit. Honestly, my brother embarrassed me. Oh my god, thank god. Signore e signori, I present to you the beloved Doja Venezia. Benvenuti! Welcome, my friends, to the grandest social event of the season. At peace or at war, in times of prosperity or paucity, Venezia will always have carnival! He's not leaving the boat. I will have to swim out there. I wouldn't try it. He spotted right away. Got him. Ready. We rarely are. Que la morte non sia crudele. Requiescat in pace. All right. Beautifully done. Che spettacolo. Che spettacolo. Yes, touch my fingers. You must be exhausted. Come, relax. Ah, the savior of Venezia. What can I say? Perhaps it was wrong of me to doubt so readily. Now, we'll see where all the pieces fall. Enough of that now. You've worked hard, my son. I feel your tired body in need of comfort and succor. But I have such aches and pains, sister. I may need a great deal of comfort and succor. Oh, that can be arranged. Girls! Hmm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and now, let's see who has AIDS. But that's okay. Kind of.